Hello you guys and welcome back to today's video. Today I'm using a microphone which is a first for me. I think I'm gonna continue using this one. This is my first video that I have. I'm actually recording it with a microphone and I think it makes it easier. Let me know what you guys think. Today I am describing to you how I feel about this two moisturizers. One is for the day and one is for the night. So this is they are a little bit backwards. So let's say day, night. Um, overall I think they are phenomenal for hydration. Would I recommend them? I wouldn't recommend them. They are $120 each and they don't have anything amazing anti-aging that I can definitely say that it changed my skin. It, it just didn't. I honestly feel like they are a good good moisturizer to have on and if you've received this as a gift or you purchase this or someone else, you know, I don't know. Someone, somehow you got this one in your hands. They are great for hydration. They are more of a gel formula one thing i didn't notice uh, one thing i didn't like about this product is the fact that the product stays on the pump it does has two formulas i read and read and read and and look for kind of a um, a reason in why they would have two pumps and it only makes sense that one is the moisturizer and, and the other one is more of the serum type formula that makes it more of a gel like texture uh, overall i don't think it makes any difference on my skin uh, when it comes to doing any for anti-aging benefits Let's see how it's very good for hydration but i feel like if you're looking for a little bit more heavier you'll definitely have to find something different uh, overall like i said did it improve my hydration it didn't it just stayed hydrated i, I don't think it changed anything i think it any kind of a um, Moisture Surge, Hydro Boost Gel by Neutrogena, or any Niacinamide by Naturium now uh, can do, and potentially that those can do a little bit more than this very expensive moisturizers. That's the reason why I'm not recommending this product. And that is one of the reasons why I'm being and staying true to myself. Um, I do like the texture. I feel like they they glide into your skin. They feel amazing, but do they do anything exciting for you? They are just good hydrating moisturizers and nothing else like I, I just couldn't justify to pay $120 for this ones. I think Elemis overall has other products to offer that are better, greater, have more benefits or could potentially be less expensive than $240 in moisturizers that are, to be honest, not worth it. If you guys have any reviews, recommendations, anything else in regards to a hydrating, pumping moisturizer that you like, let me know in the comments down below. If you found that these products work well for you, let me know also why did they work for you because I, I don't think it changed anything on, on our skin, but that's uh, that's us. So I hope you guys liked this video. Please subscribe to the channel, click on the notification button, stay notified, and I'll see you guys soon.